I'm the Dirty Chef Ian Russo. I'm gonna show you how to prepare tuna steak with lemon slices today. The twist on this is I'm gonna teach you how to pick seafood in the supermarket that'll be so fresh it won't smell while you're cooking it. It's a very simple recipe. There's probably only two things you really need to be careful of is making sure the fish is fresh and that it's the right thickness. As far as buying tuna steaks, it should be red and fish should be so fresh that when you put it to your nose, close your eyes, you shouldn't know any seafoods there. And if you really want to try what I'm speaking of, you basically close your eyes, put it right to your nose, and you should never smell anything. If you walk into a sushi restaurant, you never really smell seafood. So if you're cooking fish at home and you start smelling oils and smells like fish, it's probably not fresh. So the size of the steaks also, it's about an inch thick. If they were too thin, they'll cook real fast and they won't be juicy inside. So what I'm gonna do here is season the steaks with salt. And what I do is I call it a snowing method. I season from a higher level and I make sure this tuna is seasoned on all sides. I did front and back and now I'm also gonna do the sides. There's actually four of them and I'm just rolling it with my hand and getting the salt evenly throughout the piece of tuna. And then what I'm gonna do is dip it in my dirty dust, which is nine spices, and a lot of people say it transforms food. I dip it in, whatever amount the dirty dust sticks is the perfect amount. And then what we're gonna do in the kitchen, we're gonna sear these, sear them off, caramelize the dirty dust, and slice them rare. Mm -hmm. 